Oh. Oh. Get it done again. Team presentation. The crowd is buzzing for it. Big, big crowd. Actually, do you know what? It looks decent from here. I can hear some noise to be fair. It's mainly uh, for MXGP TV. It's mainly for the fans at home. Once again, just doing it for the fans at home. Where's our flag? Uh, Mark had one, but it was too big. So, just got this bad boy. <laughs> oh, England, England, mate. In Great Britain. Sorry. It's got to keep them right, do you know what I mean? Big do, team England. Do my, oi! Let's do a bit for Scotland. That's what the blue is in there, that's the Scottish flag, you do know that. <laughs> for the Saturday, track walk, new helmets, new gear, a little bit of a team presentation, so uh, let's get into the action tomorrow. Rob, that was a good start to the day. I'll take it. I'm just saying, if that doesn't give you goosebumps in motocross, then you need to quit. You need to quit. Oh, oh mate, Na proper nations or not, nations, nations. It, what's a proper nation? Uh, us versus the world. Yeah. This is perfect. It's us yeah. versus the world. It's the nations. Isn't it? Same difference. It's just, it's not nothing else to describe it. Just watching your your team countryman do his job, flying the colours, cheering on a Yamaha. Gee, what's going on? No pressure. Well, you can look at it two ways, can't you? It's either no pressure because the boys have already got a couple of good results in, or no pressure, the boys have got good results. So get your A game on. I meant the latter. Oh, did you? I meant the, the premiere. Oh. This is what you call fully custom. Now we're talking. What were we saying, Rob? I think everyone's loading in a line. What do you reckon of this? A little touch here just for the Scottish fans. Is that you? No. <laughs> I was going to come up with a really bad dad joke there, but we thought we'd, uh, we'd quit those after last week. I'm multitasking, look. People taking pictures of me and everything. I think you can anyway. Yeah, it was the last of that that rhythm lane down the bottom, yeah. and it was just carnage, and I just yeah. somebody just jumped right across, and I just landed right yeah, on their back, no like gun. seat. And as I went down, I don't know if my thumb got caught or got. I hope it's just stayed.
No. Could just be badly staved. I've like staved them before when they feel like really like bad. Was it on the back jump? Yeah, the first lap. Did that happen? Crash the air? Yeah, like some guy just jumped across me and I like landed on a seat. I hit the gate with like five or six other guys. Like yeah, it, more. It, it really flinched. I oh, like heard ten, everyone go ten, for it at the start. Not sure. It's probably ten sort of ten in the gate. I thought they were gonna red flag it. Yeah, well as I was pulling out, I thought, oh, surely it's a red flag. Yeah. But everyone was kind of like waiting around, and didn't really know if they were going to stop it or not. Sunday morning, motocross of nations. Bit of a tough blow yesterday. Hit the start gate and my quali race was in amongst a load of people I'm not used to racing with and it was a bit of carnage. And I just thought I need to get around the first lap without, you know, really too much issues. And I jumped the, the last little tabletop on the rhythm lane. And I was just holding my line, went straight as I could, and uh, you know, a guy from Sweden, I think it was, come right across and just jumped right in front of my front wheel. And I just landed on his back and his back mud guard and his seat went down and just really badly jarred my thumb, you know, just ripped it right back. Um, thought I'd maybe broken my, my thumb, but went and got it checked out at the medical center and they said that uh, there's a ligament that runs down here, which is, it's not completely broken, but it's torn. Um, and yeah, it's pretty swollen up this morning, pretty sore. Taking some ibuprofen, paracetamol. Gonna get Sordi to help me uh, tape it up and see if we can see if we can ride today. So all fun and games, but I was made for this stuff. Cool with my kit as well. Listen, mate, practicality. Look at the size of it. That's without tape on it. Top. Yeah. All strapped up. Ready for action. Lovely job. I'll tell you what, Captain Swordfish done a good job on that. Solid as a rock. Thumbs up. Love option number two. Give him a go. 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 Try and, yeah. try and do that. Obviously, we'll try and go for a better than that, mm. but... Yeah, if you get a sling, then you can get a sling. Yeah. <laughs> My granny used to say, take your time, not win. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> take your time, hurry up. Yeah. <laughs> right, boys, I'll see you up there. Good luck, mate. See you in a minute.
there's no point in washing it then. Oh, is it just washing the wheel? At one point, I thought how I didn't even remember I had it. Ah, right. I think I might just take the tape off for this one. I've got no strength in it, but it's not giving me any pain. Possibly, yeah, I might just leave it on. What do you think? If it's not bothering you, you try it out. He's holding it! the job. Still got it. Old yes. dog. Gammy thumb. Let's go. Get it done again. Tough old, tough old moto, but that was the thumb hanging on. Oh, she's still there. Uh, can't say it was easy, but second moto definitely helped. Motivation when you see. Let's uh, yeah, we'll go. Only a couple of points off the win, so it's only a matter of time. Come on! Yeah, fucking awesome. Oh, so close! Two points! Woo! Yeah. 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 Did you see Daddy? <laughs> Did you see me up there? Angus Smith's Daddy's prize! Look at this! You can wear that. Once it's back on four past six. Might have to wait all up at some point. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah.